Alonso goes to the outside as he made it. He's gone for broke and it's cost him. Lewis Hamilton leads in Montreal. He's rewriting the book of what is possible. Lewis Hamilton wins! I have to dedicate this one to my dad. Without him, this wouldn't be possible. This could be the lead going for Hamilton. They are side by side. Hamilton holds his nerve. An absolutely stunning drive. <laughs> the first British driver to win in America for 24 years. Lewis Hamilton takes his third victory in Formula One. Brilliant, Lewis. Brilliant, brilliant. That was superb. It has been one of the most difficult and treacherous Grand Prix in the history of Formula One racing. That was the drive of a champion. Doing your last lap, thinking about some of the races that Senna was in and Prost, and make me feel that I'm on my way to achieving something similar to them. He takes his fifth victory, the first for McLaren here since 2003. Fantastic job, guys. The car was incredible. Another 17 races like that this week. Oh, Lewis is in the barrier. He's got a right rear puncture. I apologise for hitting the barrier, but I made up for it. A magnificent, inspired performance by him. Lewis, well done. Well done. Let's go and party tonight, all right? He came here to Silverstone and he has shown them all with one of the great, great drives. I love you, man. I love you too, man. This is it, surely. He's got the beautiful slipstream move there. Massa will have to go inside. He'll have to stay inside, otherwise Hamilton will just steal it. A fantastic performance, aggressive when he needed to be. A wonderful victory for Lewis Hamilton. Great drive, Lewis. We're very sorry that we made it a little bit more difficult for you. <laughs> That's okay, that's okay, Ron, that's a good excuse, don't worry. <laughs> Lewis Hamilton wins the Chinese Grand Prix. Where last year the dreams shattered. Well, this is another step towards the championship and towards my dream. He's a winner again! The first time in 2009, the world champion takes the checkered flag. Great job, guys! Fantastic! He started on pole and he's taken the checkered flag! Lewis Hamilton wins for McLaren in Singapore. Me and Jensen had a good little battle, he got me on the outside. Fortunately, he was able to get him back into turn one, so... The first time win for Lewis Hamilton in 2010. Formula One's back in North America, and Lewis Hamilton wins again in Canada. It's his first victory here at this famous circuit, and it's just what McLaren needed after Hungary. Hamilton fancies a look up the inside into turn one, and Button had to give him some space. The gap now just 1.6 seconds, and he's looking at the inside, he's through! Lewis Hamilton brilliantly wins the Chinese Grand Prix. One of the best races I've ever really experienced, and I think, you know, I haven't won a race for quite some time. It just feels great to be able to put everything together. Lewis Hamilton wins the German Grand Prix at Nürburgring. Hamilton is back. Tremendous victory here in Abu Dhabi. Just know what I want, know how I want it and how to get it, and I've just been dedicating myself to that. He has won twice in Canada before. The hat-trick is now Lewis Hamilton's. What a great feeling. I loved every single minute of it. It's Lewis Hamilton for the 19th time in Formula One. A hat-trick of wins in Budapest. It is Lewis Hamilton's first win in Italy at Monza. Standing on the podium and you see thousands and thousands and thousands of people. I mean, that's incredible. He's getting a great toe, but he pulls out and pulls past. Hamilton leads from Vettel. Lewis Hamilton sees the chequered flag and wins in Austin the US Grand Prix. We have kind of a real world world tour race, just hunting him down the whole time. It was uh, one of my favorites. I feel like I have a good baseline. I feel like it's something we can really work on. It's a fourth win in Hungary. It's a first win for Mercedes. Hamilton wins the Hungarian Grand Prix. This is probably one of the most important Grand Prix wins of my career. To move to a new team, to win for Mercedes-Benz, is just a, a really, a real privilege. Lewis Hamilton takes the cheers from the crowd and his team and wins the Malaysia Grand Prix. Will he leave him any space? He's Absolutely gone off the not. track. He's gone completely off the track, Nico Rosberg, but he's certainly not given up yet. He now has to as Hamilton slots back into the lead again. Hamilton triumphs in Bahrain. I was on the, on the knife edge the whole time, but it was great fun and, of course, a real relief when I got across the line. <laughs> Get in there, Lewis. Excellent drive there. Absolutely epic. It's 
the Spanish Grand Prix and the championship lead for Lewis Hamilton. My first win here in Spain, it, it means, means everything to me. It's Hamilton pointing to the crowd, saying thank you and winning the British Grand Prix. Russell's gone deep again. This time it's cost him the lead of the race. Hamilton wins the Italian Grand Prix. It's another one-two for Mercedes. Grazie a tutti. And now Hamilton's got DRS. And now Hamilton has got the lead back again in the Singapore Grand Prix. Winner in 2009. In 2014, it's the win. And it's the championship lead for Lewis Hamilton. Difficult race. Uh, very difficult ending uh, as well. It's a first win at the Russian Grand Prix, and it goes to the championship leader, Lewis Hamilton. They almost touch at the end of the back straight as Hamilton takes over the lead. Lewis Hamilton wins the US Grand Prix once more. It's Lewis Hamilton, champion of the world in 2014. But Hamilton has started out in 2015 in perfect style and from pole to chequered flag, it's Lewis Hamilton that wins the Australian Grand Prix. It is another race win. It is a second race win in 2015 for Lewis Hamilton. It's the chequered flag and victory once again here in Bahrain for Lewis Hamilton, the championship leader now crosses the line to win his fourth Canadian Grand Prix. It's Hamilton who wins. It's a first ever win here in Montreal for the Brackley team. It is the hat-trick of British Grand Prix wins. I couldn't have done it without you guys. I could see you every lap. I could see you in the corner of my eye and I just felt you spurring me along. So thank you so much. Back in the lead here at Spa. Back winning again at Spa. Once again, it is victory at Monza for Lewis Hamilton. It's the Japanese Grand Prix for Lewis Hamilton. The championship lead extends. Hamilton crosses the line and wins the Russian Grand Prix. It's back-to-back -back success here for Hamilton. Rosberg just went a little bit wide and the lead has changed hands because there is Nico Rosberg. It is the championship in 2015 for Lewis Hamilton. It is back-to-back -back championships. Three times world champion, Lewis. I'm just so grateful, thank you. For the first time in 2016, and wins in Monaco for the second time. Five Canadian Grand Prix victories as Hamilton wins. Float like a butterfly, sting like a bee. In towards turn two, his teammates got the inside oh, line, they've touched again! Hamilton takes the Austrian Grand Prix, the 250th Grand Prix win by a British driver. He's now going to win three times in a row, the first man to take a hat-trick of British Grand Prix wins in succession. And for the fifth time, takes the win at the Hungarian Grand Prix. Hamilton wins the German Grand Prix. Get in there, Lewis. It is going to be a fourth win in Texas, a fifth win in the United States. Hamilton has come to Mexico City and he is winning the Mexico Grand Prix. It's Hamilton once more. Brazil! <laughs> for the third race in a row, taking the victory. Right now, I'm losing the World Championship, so I'm not really bothered if I win or lose this race. Lewis Hamilton wins the Abu Dhabi Grand Prix. Nico Rosberg is second. He takes the championship. Nobody's been ahead of Lewis Hamilton today and wins the Chinese Grand Prix. Hamilton gaining all the time. Fennel blocks him off on the inside. Hamilton goes round the outside and swoops into the lead of the Spanish Grand Prix. It's his 55th win in Formula One. Guys, what can I say? Fantastic job this weekend. Ten years after his maiden win in Formula One, he has won for a sixth time in Montreal. It's a fifth British Grand Prix win! Home Grand Prix, mate. We've got the best fans here. Thank you, everyone, who turned up. I see you out there!
and he wins in Spa. Hamilton now seven points behind Sebastian Vettel. The 58th Grand Prix win for Lewis Hamilton. He takes the championship lead for the first time in 2017 and wins the Italian Grand Prix. Mercedes power is definitely better than Ferrari power, so it worked well this weekend. Ooh. Kimi Raikkonen on the inside, oh. and he's cracked with Verstappen, he's hit Vettel as well. Raikkonen is out before the first corner, and he's gone into the Red Bull there as well. It is victory number 60 in Formula One. Obviously, he was very fortunate with the Ferraris at the beginning. Uh, I couldn't be, couldn't be happy. I'm really grateful. It is a 59-point lead at the top of the championship now. Get in there, Lewis boy. That's a fantastic result. It's a fifth win out of six races in Austin. I love this track. I think this track is now my favorite track, to be honest. Oh, and there's a puncture! He takes the checker flag now to win in Baku. He's going to break Michael Schumacher's record as well and notch up his 41st win from pole position. Lewis Hamilton takes the checkered flag and wins the French Grand Prix here at Circuit Paul Ricard. And out of the race, Sebastian Vettel! It's not going to be Sebastian Vettel's day. Lewis Hamilton regains the lead in the championship. It's a sixth win in the Hungarian Grand Prix for Lewis Hamilton. Look at Hamilton alongside Vettel. Oh, so close. He'll struggle and to get around there. They touch Martin Hamilton and Vettel has been spun round. And he is going to win once more as Hamilton takes the checkered flag and the Italian Grand Prix victory. Fantastic weekend all around. Really, really solid. Well done, mate. What a weekend. Keep pushing. Keep pushing. Has he got enough on the Ferrari? Under braking to squeeze down the inside. Hamilton's done it! And for the third time in his Formula One career, wins the Russian Grand Prix. Woohoo! I love you guys. I love driving the car. I love this track. It is Hamilton's day in Suzuka. His 50th win in 99 races in the Turbo Hybrid era. He comes home to win the Abu Dhabi Grand Prix and to crown a championship winning season with victory in the final race. Can Hamilton get ahead of Bottas? He does! Down towards the final corner, takes the lead. Lewis Hamilton wins the Bahrain Grand Prix. A four-time world champion acknowledges a five-time world champion is going to see the checkered flag first and claim a hat-trick of Spanish Grand Prix wins. We're going to lose this race on I can't look after this size anymore, they're dead. Here goes Verstappen down the inside on Lewis Hamilton, they make contact! Around the streets of Monte Carlo and extend his lead at the top of the championship, Hamilton wins the Monaco Grand Prix! That one's for Nicky, mate, that one is for Nicky. I know he'll be uh, looking down and know he will take his hat off today. Oh, he's oh! gone wide. Sebastian Vettel goes wide and Lewis Hamilton thought there was a gap. Sebastian Vettel takes the checkered flag, but Lewis Hamilton wins the Canadian Grand Prix. He thinks he's number one today. Lewis Hamilton wins the French Grand Prix from pole position. That was an absolutely blistering drive there, mate. One, two, three, four, five, six British Grand Prix wins. He does it. Fastest lap on the last lap. It's lights out and away we go. Verstappen does get an excellent start and Hamilton too. 41 laps ago, Max Verstappen put those tyres on. Hamilton pulls out and makes his way round. Wow. Just wow, mate. It's another win to add to his collection. That's exactly what we needed. We never give up. And he comes home to win the Mexico Grand Prix. It is Lewis Hamilton winning in Abu Dhabi to cap a championship winning season in 2019. I think we are living in a time of an awakening and people you know, particularly with the whole movement that's going on. I think people are waking up and thinking, oh my God, we do need to do more.
He comes round the final corner to win the Styrian Grand Prix and he picks up his first victory of the season. It's the Hungarian Grand Prix for the eighth time for Lewis Hamilton. Believe it or not, it's still pushing out there. That's one, that's Lewis Hamilton. And look at his left front tire. Lewis Hamilton, the race leader. He's led every single lap of this race. A record seventh British Grand Prix victory for the most wins at home. It's Lewis Hamilton. It's another Spanish Grand Prix victory for Lewis Hamilton. It's the Belgian Grand Prix for Lewis Hamilton. That one was for Chadwick. Chadwick Bosman, man. Rest in peace, King. There goes Lewis Hamilton into the lead, ahead of his teammate. It's another new track to win at for Lewis Hamilton and wins the Tuscan Grand Prix in 2020. So it was a oh, lock up here yeah. by Bottas. Lewis Hamilton goes past Valtteri Bottas. It's win number 91. The record is equaled. Schumacher and Hamilton, the most successful drivers of all time in terms of race wins. Seeing his dominance for so long, I, I don't think anyone, and especially me, didn't imagine that I'd be uh, anywhere near Michael in terms of records. So it's an incredible honor. Is Hamilton close enough down this main straight? Bottas moves over to the right-hand side. Hamilton pulls out, goes alongside, goes ahead and into the lead. Started on pole, back into the lead now of the Portuguese Grand Prix. The man that woke up this morning on the verge of an historic 92nd win in Formula One. Records are there to be broken, said Michael Schumacher. The record is broken. Hamilton has more wins than any other driver in Formula One history. Lewis, 92, 92. Actually couldn't have done this without all of you. Thank you so much for continuing to believe in me, continuing to strive for perfection. It's such an honor to work with you guys. Thank you. And for Lewis Hamilton, 161st visits to a Formula One podium, but his first time as the record holder for the most amount of wins in Formula One. Hamilton on top, as he so often is.